Hey City Kids, it is Leah here, and this month we're talking about all things that go together. You can even see some behind me, right? We got milk and cookies, yum. Chips and salsa, extra yum. What else? What else can you think of that goes together? I know something. What about a BFF, right? Someone you call a BFF. Have you ever had someone you call a BFF? Maybe just the sound of that has you thinking of somebody right now. BFF. What does it stand for? Best friend forever. But it's hard to be a BFF, even with the best of intentions sometimes, isn't it? It's hard for you and for me, but not for Jesus. Jesus is the one friend that not only wants to be our friend forever, but he actually can keep his end of the promise. And he went through a lot to make that possible. That's why all month long, we are sharing the good news that Jesus wants to be my friend and your friend forever. Again, your friend, my friend, everyone's friend forever. The best things that go together are my friends, Jesus, and me. And nothing, not even death can come between us and his promise because we go together forever and ever. Now, speaking of friends, I've got to go get my friend to help with the memory first. See you in a minute. Come on, come on, come on. Hi. I got my friend, guys. <laughs> Yay. Yay. <laughs> See, we've been talking about friends all month long, right? Amazing. I'm so thankful to have a good friend like you. I know. I'm thankful for you, too. <laughs> so hopefully you brought a friend, grab your parents or even your dog whoever can help you with the memory verse today. But Amazing. Before we get there, Yancy, I'm gonna ask you a few okay. questions. Oh, okay. There's a verse in the Bible. It's actually our memory verse for this month. Oh, okay. And it tells us that God is with us, that Jesus is with us, because he's that good of a friend. But mm. now let's see, is he with us just sometimes? Um, I don't, I don't think so. I think, okay. I mean, it's not just sometimes, right? Like, okay, well, what about- He is with us sometimes, but- it seems like it's more than that. What about when we're, only when we're scared? Is Jesus with us only when we're scared? Um, he's definitely with us when we're scared, but right, but not just when we're scared. Okay, okay, okay. So is he also with us when we're kind of nervous before like a big test or like before going to school? Ooh, yeah, but Don't not worry. just when we're nervous. Okay, okay. How about is he with us all the time? Could he? Could he do that? That's it. He's with us all the time he's the best friend we could have absolutely and so that's our verse this month city kids so yancy's gonna repeat after me and you guys are gonna okay. follow with yancy and then okay. we'll do it all together okay. okay so here we go i i am with you am with you always always matthew 28 verse 20 Matthew 28, verse 20. Okay, do you think you got that? Did I do it right? I think so. Okay. Kids, how do you think okay. you did? Did I do it? How did you guys do? So let's do it together, okay. nice and loud voices, all of us together with all of our friends, all of our pets, whoever is with us, to let's remember this together. All right, here we go. Okay. I am with you always. Matthew 28, 20. Wow, good job, City Kids. Give your friend a big high five. Yeah. Yes, amazing. So get ready, stand up for the countdown, and then we're gonna get ready to dance and sing together. Here we go. No matter what, no matter what, Jesus' love for me will never change. No way, eh. He's always there, He's always there, taking care of me, and I believe Jesus, you and me are friends forever. We are, we are. I know, friends forever. We are, we are. I know, 
time it is. It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you. Hey friends, I'm Poppy. My aunt gave me this fun baby bathtub so I could pretend to give all my toy friends a bath. I found all this fun stuff that goes together with a bath. Like, what's this? A rubber ducky. That's right. Rubber duckies go together with bath time. Do you know what else goes together with bath time? Bubbles. Bubbles are so much fun! Let's all splash and make lots of pretend bubbles. Ready? Splish, splash, splish, splash. Bubbles go together with bath time too. There's another thing that goes together with bath time. A fuzzy towel! Towels go together with bath time. Grrr. Alrighty, now who needs a bath? Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Poppy! Who? Who? Playing with things that go together, are you? Hey, Ollie! I sure am! All these things go together with my new baby bathtub! Tubs and duckies go together, it's true! But I know a friend who goes together with you! Listen to this story! Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Uno, dos, tres. Oh, hola, friends. It's so good to see you. My name's Luis. I'm getting a fun game ready for my niece's birthday party. <laughs> it's called Ducks and Water. They just go together, don't they? <laughs> We're going to see how many of these ducks we can get to float in this little pool. <laughs> this reminds me of a story from the Bible. Do you want to help me build it? Great. Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno. Dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, that's perfect. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins at a beach where... Jesus had been teaching people all day. Jesus told his friends, the disciples, to get in a boat to go across the lake. Jesus said goodbye to the crowd and he went up to a mountain to pray by himself. While the disciples were in the boat, the wind began to blow. Can you help me be the wind? Put your arms up like this and be the wind. Woo, woo, woo. Ready? One, two, Three, go! <laughs> Keep going! <laughs> okay, stop. The wind was rocking the boat back and forth, and the disciples didn't know what to do. Just then, they saw something on the water. Do you see it? Raise your hand if you see it. Oh, it looks like... A person! Jesus' friends were scared. Ooh, can you show me your scared faces? That's exactly how they felt. And they thought, could there really be a person walking on water? Huh. Who do you think it was walking on the water towards them? Hmm. Let's see. All of a sudden, the person said, it's me. 
don't be afraid. It was Jesus walking on the water. The disciples were so happy to see Jesus and amazed to see him walking on water because they didn't think anyone could walk on the water. <laughs> well, right away, Peter said, Jesus, if it's you, tell me to walk to you on the water. And Jesus said, come. Peter stepped out of the boat. Guess what? Peter started walking on the water towards Jesus. Only Jesus could help Peter walk on the water. But then Peter looked around and he saw the wind and he got scared and he started to sink in the water. But Jesus reached out and caught him so he wouldn't sink. Then they got back in the boat together. Wow, Jesus was with Peter and Jesus is always with us too. Jesus wants to be our friend forever. Hey there, Ollie, tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus was always with Peter, and Jesus is always with you, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, Jesus is always with Peter, and Jesus is always with us. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Good! Bubbles and bath time go together. But the best thing that goes together are my friend Jesus and me. See you guys next time. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.